yeah good morning students uh, this is kv ramesh anthropology faculty and so this year we are launching long term test series in anthropology who are uh, who have been preparing it for 2024 so now we can see that so what is chapter wise test series how did earlier students got benefited and this year we got 22nd ranker from our chapter wise test series so how they are benefited and how to proceed it so how many levels are there what is the uh, syllabus breakage and everything that we are going to see in this session so our session name is so chapter wise test series also called as long term test series this long term chapter wise test series it has been designed to cater so fragmentation approach so it is built on the approach of fragmentation so fragmentation means if you could not do a bigger task at a time you divide the task into smaller smaller one then it made into bigger task is easier so now you can see that so most of the time many people they had enrolled test series with me but when the test series is like a you know uh, every sunday so if it has sufficient syllabus they could not able to finish that syllabus and they are dropping from the test series so to make this one every student should continue test series and every student get flexibility and it could be easier to explain one to one evaluation i brought this kind of idea that fragmentation approach based long term chapter wise test series so it is basically for who done their coaching and they are preparing for 2024 and who had started right now could not know how to proceed because it is chapter wise here it is kind of mentorship program also so while writing a particular chapter if you get any doubts doubts will be cleared explained cleared during the time of evaluation so thereby it's test series as well as mentorship program those people who have no clarity over the subject who had finished their coaching but not yet started their writing practice and who are preparing uh, for 2024 so on uh, this year they could not made into this prelims so these kind of people can opt this test series so here in the fragmentation approach first the student will start with the unit wise test so per se you can pick up socio cultural anthropology so in socio cultural anthropology every unit per se 2.1 and 2.2 as one test so 2.3 marriage chapter is one test 2.4 the family chapter is one test 2.5 uh, kinship chapter is one test that means here test means you could not expect like a 20 plus questions it's kind of mini tests in every uh, test we have six questions section a which has short answer question section b which has long answer question both from three and three questions six questions you will get so means most of the important questions from that chapter would be covered in the unit test and next one is sectional test once you finished all the chapters in socio cultural anthropology the next thing is you will attend sectional test 250 duration par with pattern so now you can see that so you will get sufficient time to prepare your notes to uh, test your knowledge on the particular unit or chapter and you will be comfortably ready for the sectional test if i give you all socio cultural anthropology into two tests most of the people damn sure they won't come for the exam why because they could not able to finish those many uh, units in two weeks that is the problem so now grand test so like this once you done your socio cultural anthropology now you enter into the physical or biological anthropology third you will go for the archaeological anthropology then once you finish this unit and sectional test then you will attack on the paper one grand test 250 marks and uh, three hours duration as per upsc format so the same thing will replicate for paper two also so every unit in indian society and civilization later every unit in tribal india and after that sectional test on indian society and civilization and sectional test on tribal india so this is the way long term so you can take it as four months so study each chapter each concept make notes for each chapter and each concept make your answer sorry very unique by going by adding more inputs for that questions so by following this one you will make your content and that content is very unique you, you will easily get 330 plus marks so that i am promising if you pop, this is this is kind of burden work it's not that much easy 
every day you have to sit on the anthropology for next four months so if you follow this one you would easily get 330 plus marks nobody can stop it and so the duration is four months so if you have material and you are available in the delhi i will give you personal hard copies if you are staying far away you would get access to the anthropedia block so these are all the features of this program so now you can see how i made so this year tests we are starting from july 5th so july 5th so from july 5th you will start with the socio cultural anthropology module so you can see here so july 5th test 1 july 8 a uh, marriage chapter july 10 family july 13 kinship july 16 economic organization july 19 political organization july 22nd religion july 26th theories part 1 july 31 theories part 2 august 0 to august 2nd linguistic anthropology august 5th field work creation august 10th you would finish entire uh, social cultural anthropology in the form of sectional test so this is the starting of the first module next you will go to the physical or biological anthropology same uh, test number 13 august 13 genetic uh, uh, human genetics methods and application august 15 mendelian genetics august 18 population genetics august 22 chromosomal aberrations august 25th racial studies august 28th genetic marker august 31 ecological anthropology september 2nd epidemiological anthropology september 5th human growth and development september 8 reproductive and demographic anthropology september 11 applications of physical anthropology september 15 so you can see organic evolution september 18 primatology september 21 home marine evolution september 28 the test number is 27 and you will write the sectional test on physical uh, entire physical anthropology as a sectional test for 250 marks so this is all about physical and biological anthropology so when it comes to the prehistory archaeological anthropology here you can see that october 1st you will write a test on dating methods october 3rd you will write a test on paleolithic cultures from india as well as the world october 15th you will write mesolithic cultures so from indian world october 7th you will write neolithic cultures and october 9th chalcolithic and bronze age cultures and october 11 iron age and ethno archaeology so this is the way you will finish archaeological anthropology branch also by going unit tests so indian society and civilization so demographic profile of india one test traditional indian society one test caste system in india one test so lp with the concepts of civilization studies as well as various other religious impact on the indian society one test growth of indian anthropology another test so indian village studies another unit test and minorities problems in india so that is another uh, unit test and you can see social change in india another test and you will write a sectional test that is test number 42 by october 31st so this is another test so tribal india so similarly tribal india also you will get the testers like so november 2nd tribal situation in india as one unit test november 4th tribal problems as one unit test november 6th tribe forest and displacement displacement problems november 18th november 8 so 7.1 7.2 7.3 november 10 8.1 8.2 november 12 9.1 9.2 9.3 november 14th sectional test on so tribal india so this is the way first you will write all the section uh, you know unit tests followed by sectional test and followed by grant test if you follow this one free readings and sufficient notes you will once you, cl you clear the prelims you just uh, revise this content and you will you will become a single digit ranker that i am 100 percent sure and you will get easily 330 plus mark so this is all about so how do you uh, enroll in this program so very simple enrollment so test first test on july 5th if you miss this date so you have to be continued for the second test so for suppose if you joined in the july 8th so you will start second test not the first test first test will be uh, uh, right later time so you can enroll into this course through website like our uh, anthropedia has that links and everything or else directly you can make a payment on my number 824709436 you will submit so you will submit your name phone number email and payment receipt as well as photo one photo so these are all the basic details required to start your program so this test uh, this long term test series i am launching it from offline students in delhi circles as well as online students from entire nation